Hi guys, welcome to another LP. This, as you probably just guessed, is Max Payne 3. But I'm trying something different. So this is going to be a special LP. I'm going to... Monday to Friday will be my normal LP days, which at the moment is Skyrim and Battlefield 3. So then, them two will go up every night as usual. Or every morning or whatever it is that you guys are awake. Uh, this will go up on Saturday and it's going to be an hour long and I'm going to do it once a week and then Sunday will, if I can, will be a co-op LP with somebody and if they can't do the co-op for that week or whatever then I'll just do another episode of Max Payne 3 I'm just going to roll with this for a while see how it goes so yeah I'm starting this, it's going to be an hour long episode and it's only going to be once a week unless someone can't do Sunday co-op and then it'll be twice a week so hang on get rid of this crappy little steam message now we begin oh shit sign in forgot about this probably should have done this beforehand whatever <sighs> go away social club What? There's meant to be an intro video. Where's it gone? Okay, well, there's no intro video in this, so I guess you'll get more gameplay. Uh, I'll put a link to an intro video on YouTube so you can watch it if you're really that interested. Right, uh, new, hardcore, and old school. <laughs> no, medium. <laughs> no chance. Actually. Damn it, can't put subtitles on. I fudged up. I'm gonna have to wait till this cutscene's over. Right. Now there's a lot of cutscenes in this game, from what I've heard, so. You have to bear with it. So I guess I've become what they wanted me to be a killer. Some red clown with a gun who puts holes in other bad guys. Well, that's what they had paid for, so in the end, that's what they got. Say what you want about Americans, but we understand capitalism. You buy yourself a product, and you get what you pay for. And these chumps had paid for some angry gringo without the sensibilities to know right from wrong. Here I was, about to execute this poor bastard like some dime store angel of death. And I realized they were correct. I wouldn't know right from wrong if one of them was helping the poor and the other was banging my sister. Oh. Looking a bit more respectable here. That was obviously the future. I'd arrived in Sao Paulo a few weeks before. I was working a protection detail for the kind of people who need protection in a town like this. And what kind of town was this? One where I didn't speak the language and they didn't water down their drinks. So for now, we seem to get along just fine. Of course, <laughs> that was about to change. Hey, brother. Hey. Hey. How's the cocktail? It's scotch. I never mix my drinks. Yeah, well, at least not on duty. Something like that. Man, that favela is big. Yep. Nothing like the view of extreme poverty to make a penthouse cocktail party really swing. <laughs> I guess they call it trickle-down economics. <laughs> That's funny. It's supposed to be a charity thing. Drink and give money. I don't know. Something for the kids. Hey, listen, man. We better look lively. This place is a nightmare. They just got cowboys running security downstairs. Something rotten in the air. That didn't mean much. There was always something rotten in the air. The family we were protecting were local celebrities, rich parasites with delusions of humanity. The kind of people <laughs> who end up in glossy magazines or body bags, depending on how their luck runs. So where are they all? I see Rodrigo over there talking to that guy. Yeah, I don't know him. That guy next to him. He's some kind of cop. Uh, I think, I'm not sure. Serious though. Big end cop, anti-gang sort of thing. And I can't remember his name. Who's this guy? That guy's a plastic surgeon or some kind of surgeon. Uh, tummy tucks and cock implants. Ha! 
Look at Marcel. Still dances like a fool. Guess that's what a European education and a co-capital do for Ricky Martin was <laughs> like. That's very funny, Max. Oh, excuse me. What an epic dancer. I was mostly working for Rodrigo Bronco, a local businessman. He built things, did some charity, had things named after him, won awards, owned things, people. One of the trophies he had won was his wife, Fabiana. She was hot and wanted to be dangerous. Some good genes trying to fight their way out of a cesspit. She'd married well and was now at leisure to regret her good fortune. They got along as well as any rich workaholic and his younger airhead wife tend to get along. They mostly ignored each other. She spent a lot of time with his cokehead younger brother, Marcello. He was a good time guy if your idea of a good time was an expensive suit, a bottle of champagne, and nothing between the ears. The middle brother, Victor, had just walked in. He was a local politician. The guy was smoother than an oil slick on an iceberg and about as toxic. The rest of the crowd, I didn't know, but I could imagine the types. People who know if they drink enough, they won't have to feel guilty about their good fortune. Suddenly, things turned real ugly. Felt like our hangovers arrived right on cue. Oh. Oh dear. Bad things are happening. Right, it's time to kick some ass. Oh wait, no, he's putting his gun down. Pass off! Things had gone from fine to fucked up in about a second, and now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. Right now, is it? I want to kick some out. Sure. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about, trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge. Nope. Along with everything else. Press left shift and a bullet time. It was time to choose a nasty fall or a bullet to the head. W in space, shoot dodge. That's so fucking cool. How do I do a wheel? Oh, here we go. Ah, uh, jump through it. <laughs> yeah. How, how did you get behind it? <gasps> got him, got him, got, oh god, head first into a cabinet. Nice. That was the boss lady. Only this time she wasn't calling for more liquor in her cocktail. Help. Oh yeah, I just had some painkillers. They restore trashy your health. Trashy magazines and pretty trashy people. I just hoped I could keep them out of the crime section. Examine the magazine. Yeah. Can I examine this? I got bullet wound through my jacket. That's not good, is it? I didn't need a translator to know what these were. Painkillers. Yeah. Painkillers. You just press tab and restore your health. The balcony. And I hoped, not about to be thrown off it. One of the balconies, which one? Supposed to be out here. Oh no. Don't be stupid! Don't be stupid! Let it go! Let it go! Come on! It might have been stupidity, drunkenness, or maybe both. But before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks. Trying to save fallen women. Hmm. Here we go. Oh. Oh yeah. Epic shot right there. Nós cuidamos disso. Nice work. Now you need a hand? No, you. Where the hell's Rodrigo? I don't know, man. Thanks. Somebody's gotta go find him. 
Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. I'm not somebody. It's gonna be me. Yeah. I right. imagine the elevator door is opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Okay, hang on. Before I forget. Audio, no it's not an audio is it, it's gameplay. It's not gameplay. It's not gamepad. Uh, it's, is it voice chat? No. Graphics? What the hell is it? Free aim, yeah. No. Is there no subtitle option? Subtitles! How did I miss them? Alright, uh. Damn it, I just reset it to default. Why the hell did I do that? There we go. Where are you gone? You're dead. Can I take cover? I don't. You probably can, but I don't know how. Oh, <laughs> there's Q near an object to end the cover. A blind fire. Once yes. Bronco was out the door, all bets were off. I had to keep moving. Do we all wear that? Whoa. Hold down right mouse and you can slow the bullet come down. Whoosh. And then speed it up just so it gets boom. Oh wow, you can, you can keep shooting if you want to be brutal. Ooh. Massive weapon. That's what we want, right? Here we go. It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. Oh, wow. That is very cool detail. The way he holds the weapon in his other arm. Oh, oh wow. I think I'm in love with this game. Fuck yeah. Flashing buttons open doors and gates. Good to know. The control box was on the wall to the left of the gate. And he puts his gun away and he wheels it. Oh, this is so awesome. So, so awesome. It's good playing for an hour as well because it means I can get into the game a bit more. But you get into the game for like 20 minutes and then you're over and it's like, oh wow, I was just getting into it. Oh, let me press that. I keep thinking shift sprint. Search for kills, they will give you insight. I had to keep moving. I didn't want to fuck this up more than I already had. <clears throat> I had to keep moving. I love how he narrates on everything you do. <clears throat> It's like if you if right, you have to go up here, but I went back because it said search for clues, and he was like, I have to keep moving. And it's like, ah, oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, here we go. The great thing about being famous as well as rich is the bad guys know who to kidnap. Another parking lot rattling with gunfire. Was I too late? I could shoot, wouldn't it? I wonder if I could jump out of cover. Mm. Oh, I can. Somebody's hand. I see that. Oh, shit, that. Yeah, that's what you get. Nice help. I'm on my way. I'm on my way with Rodrigo. Rodrigo! Oh, they've got the gun. Run! In the tire. Yep. Rodrigo, I'm here. 
painkill and restore some health. Surviving uses one painkill. I'm actually sure what happened then, everything flashed past really quick. <laughs> oh my god, this is so epic. Enrico, it's oh, Max. did he have a shotgun? <laughs> so, right, look at look at these details, right? I'm holding this shotgun. Rodrigo was in the van. And then I get a pistol. Maybe it was like, time <laughs> to let him out. Now I have. Now he's hot. That's so cool. Like, I don't know what it is, but it's just really good. Normally games, right, they just shove a shotgun that's floating on your back. Time to let the cat out of the or it bag. just disappears in most games. Like GTA, where the hell do the guns go? He just pulls out a rocket launcher from his pocket. Right, hang on, Rodrigo. Dude, what the hell? Oh, gotta save him. Oh. <laughs> wow. You're okay. You're okay. Yeah. Come on, get up. Come on, get up. Get up. You're okay. Come with me. Just come on. It's okay. Saved you. Hey, vocês aí? Que porra vocês estão fazendo? A justiça local? Que porra você acha que é falando com meus homens assim? Você acha que tem o direito de matar as pessoas a sangue frio, Becker? Cala a boca, cuzão. Continua dando multas. I don't know what they're saying. Hopefully you can speak their language, because I can't. Fuck. You did good, Max. You say so. Don't look so good. I can't believe it in my back. The good guys are reunited, and the Commando Sombra are dead. Yes. So who's this guy? I don't know. Some kind of cop. Different branch of the police. Not Ufer, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this stuff. Politics. Everywhere politics. Shit, Max, you look kind of beat up. I've been shot by like a million guys. I'll, I'll get you home too. Come on. I've been shot so many times. He's like, oh yeah, you look beat up. Really? Oh, really? God. In. Back home, it was time for some R and R. The only way I knew how. It's him. He set it up. The hour longer. Marcelo, or whatever he was called, I can't remember. Popping pills and drinking booze. I see he's got his life together. <laughs> oh yeah, he's, he's doing good. He's doing good. And with that, I guess I was ready for bed. You should do GTA style when you're drunk. And you just fall over if you like. You like kick the back of your own foot and you just go fly. Helicopter. Chapter 2. Nothing but the second best. The following Tuesday. A couple of days later, it was back to work. Ferrying the boss's broad and his dipshit of a brother out for the night so they could recover from their brush with mortality. Then again, what did I expect? These were the kind of people who went to nightclubs in helicopters. Fabiana had brought her sister along, presumably so she could show off just how rich and empty her life was. And boy, was she about to learn the meaning of rich and empty. Max! Max! I was speaking to you! Sorry, what was that? Oh, I was saying we get into a lot of scrapes, man. <laughs> well, we're still here. Hey. Thanks to you, Max. I owe you my life. Boom. It wasn't just him, huh, baby? Oh, yes, Marcel. I'm sure you did a lot to save everyone. It's called Marcel. You were probably worried about getting blood on your stash. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Thank you, Max. I don't know what I would do without my sister. Mmm, spend even more time doing something useful. 
<laughs> you know she works in the favela. She's the good sister. Oh, shut up. <laughs> what did you hear, Baba? More bodies turned up, more people went missing. But it's horrifying. Did someone say Buzz Q? Hey. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it is a cool town, man. Hey, here we are. <laughs> Now, let me shoot you. Tell if he was talking. It's a real chill place to hang, you know? Do a little Never business, mind. have some fun. Never mind. I need it too. I've been working. I don't know who this guy is anyway. I went like really listening. Or during Fleetch Week, he has I know he's Marcelo. <laughs> you like that knife? That's about it. That's pretty funny. Is he their brother? Or is he a friend of the family? I'm gonna have to watch it, rewatch the part when I'm finished recording and check it out. I'm glad you are still with us. Come, I heard what happened. I missed you. I would have called, okay. but you know how this didn't want it to bother you. Okay. Hey, Marcel. Marcel. I think I might have an interesting investment for your brother. Well, call him up, homie. I haven't seen him for a while. Before. Last week was Fashion Week. My God. Egypt, but so beautiful. You know Anastasia? Oh, yeah, I know Anna. <laughs> I bet Max is loving this, he? he just has to walk around. But, hey, I'm having fun. How are you? Yeah, yeah. Good, good, yeah. So, how have you been? Alright. Yeah, me too. That's about, that's his night summed up. And then pushing guys to looking at whoever the girl is, I've got a name. This kind of place made me want to puke. I needed a real drink to deal with the electronic music and the robotic people. It's fucking movie from a fucking slum. You act cool with me? What's that? Nothing. Say, Max, you're a man of the world. What are you fucking doing, man? About what? What do you do about life? Look at me, I'm standing in a nightclub. Listen to the music I can't stand. I'm 5,000 miles from home. I'm armed and I'm drinking. You don't want to listen to advice from me and me, guy. <laughs> oh, Max, I love you, man. You're fucking real, you know? Oh, shit. People. Fuck them. People get me wrong. I think... I think I love a wrong woman. Oh, excuse me. Fuck you. Oh, oh, my nigga. Thank God he has left. A minute more of his drill and I would have had to put a bullet in him myself. <laughs> it soon turned out I wasn't the only one. Oh, shit's going down. People are making hand signals. That means someone's going to go down.
seen it coming, but that was no surprise. It's hard to keep your eye on the ball through the bottom of a glass. I just hoped I could Ooh. get to Fabiana and Giovanna in time. The revolver. I knew if I didn't get to the girls soon, they'd be leaving this place with either a price on their heads or a tag on their toes. Indeed. So how do I get out? Okay. Yep. The doors had been chained shut. I didn't need my Portuguese for beginners phrase book to work out what was going on. The guy making the noise was the boss. He was sending them around to cut me off from the other side. And sure enough, I a few seconds later, I had some company on the dance floor. His little body was blocking him. It's like human shield. Here we go. Uzi. Powerful. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Check this out. Double Uzis. Time was a luxury I couldn't afford. Okay, Max, I get it. I'm on my way. Here we go, here we go. I'm a good guy. Hey, so I'm a good guy. How's it going, bro? It's not good. Some guys took Giovanna and Fabiana. What? Jesus, Max. Hey, I'm on my way. No, no, no. Stay in the chopper. We'll need a way out of here. I'll go find God. the girls. God, they, they came out there. They went that way into the louse. Come here. Go, go. Get up, get up. I can't stay here. I need you to lock this door behind me. Get everybody else out of here. Son of a bitch. Get out of my face. Switch to one, so I can aim. There we go. Where's he going? There's one over there. Oi! Hey! Get, get away from me! Oh! Didn't mean to press space. I'm gonna head first into the wall. <laughs> oh, God. I do like those the way the physics work when you hit things. Off cover, off cover. Go, 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 go. I got an idea. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh, wait, I can't see him. There he is. Oh, he just went into cover. Oh, it's gonna work. It's gonna work. Oh. unfinished business and all I could think about was my unfinished scotch. There you go. Dual revolvers. I need some painkillers. Much as I like to indulge in self- ah, Don't shoot, por favor! You an American? Sure. Yeah, I'm from Steele, North Dakota, just outside of Bismarck. Anders Stetling. This is some place, huh? They, they told me it was a little fresh, but I wasn't expecting things to be quite like this. No? No, see, I've, 
I've seen things. I was a cop for 25 years. I've seen men run over by combines. I've seen husbands who just ate their wives, but a gunfight in a disco? You were a cop? Yeah, just retired. Clearly never played oh, a game. life that was. And it gave me the money to raise a family. Oh, I got a girl at college in Wisconsin and a boy who's playing football for Minnesota State. You want to see their picture? No, no, that's all right. It oh. sounds nice. Listen, you stay in here. Don't be a hero. Oh, I won't. I'm retired. Happy, healthy ex-cop. Give me a break. Yeah, I want to go back in there. I think there might be some painkillers around here somewhere. Because I do not have any, and that's not a good situation to be in in Max Bay. Come on, it's a club. Someone's got There's some another pills. delay I didn't need. This wasn't looking good. I'd almost lost the boss's wife once yes. this week. Now I was giving them two for the price of one. Much as I like to indulge in self-reflection, this wasn't the time. Yeah, I get it, Max, but you see, I'm looking for painkillers, and painkillers help you. So, plan it. I couldn't remember the last Whoa. time I'd done drugs in a nightclub. Golden 38 revolver part. Sweet. <laughs> Find all three of them, I'm guessing you can... I don't know if... This is a long time. <laughs> I don't know if it's for um, single player or in multiplayer. Who knows? Oh, loads of that. Whatever the hell they were arguing about, it was time for me to add my two cents. Where are they? <laughs> I think I'll plan. I missed. I missed. Reload, Max. One enemy. A day to pop out again. Uh. Ah. Got him. Still on the ovens, this isn't good. How do I stop crouching? Oh yeah. I didn't actually know you could crouch. I kept pressing control before, but that didn't work. I didn't think to try to see. They were still alive, at least. This crew was starting to look a lot like friends of the gate crashers at last week's party. These guys had some real issues with the Broncos. They were back to finish the job. I figured it was time to start doing mine. Out of ammo though now. Gotta pick some stuff up. Alright. Right. Need another gun. This no. wasn't the time to be second guessing action. myself. I had to hurry or I'd lose them. There we go. There we go. Now I have dual SMGs. Wait, did I just see some painkillers on there? No. What about in this door? It's locked. Never mind. Here we go. That didn't work. As usual in games, all glass seems to be bulletproof. They were headed for the helicopter pad. I had to get to the roof before Giovanni and Fabiana right. left on a long way flight. I knew this was going to be a bad idea, but in the continued absence of any good ones, I decided to go with it. Good jump. What a view. 
I guess my time in Sao Paulo wasn't quite the paid holiday of the sun I'd been promised. At least I was getting shot at by a bit of class of psychopath. These guys weren't messing around. This place was like Baghdad with G-strings. A couple of more seconds and I'd have given some poor street cleaner a crappy start to his day. Now, I had a ride to catch. Once again, man. Nice job. Come on, come on! Jesus, Max, I can't leave you alone for five minutes! What the hell happened in there? They jumped us! Same guys from the party, I think. They grabbed the girls, and the Marcelo, but he's here now. Now, don't worry about me, homie. I'm just the guy paying you lots of money to protect me. Yeah, but were you drinking? Bet your ass I was. You try staying in there for five minutes sober. Oi, Anna, look, there they are. Anna, 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 Quick, get after them. Are you crazy? You can't just leave her. Max, you gotta do something. Come on, get the rifle back there. Got him. He's making a run for it. Hey, hold on. Get him out. Move. You're going to lose her. Oh, bad shooter. Damn. There we go. Slow motion. Oh, I've, this this laser thing is not very accurate, is it? I'm, it's right on this guy, and it's not hitting him. Oh god, that I didn't see that guy. Oh, right, retry. I think that guy can run. God, I'm so bad at this. The helicopter's shaking as it would. No, 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 no! No! How long was that reload then? Did you see that? He was reloading for about 20 minutes. Right, you know what? I'm keeping my eye on all the time. This chopper's less shaky when it's moving than when it's staying still. Ah, got you that time. Oh, let's make sure. There we go. Saved that time. Max, shoot that bastard! Why is she still running? Stay on. What's the plan? I sense a bit of sarcasm in his voice, then. Come on, get him up! Move, you're gonna lose her! She's headed for the roof! We gotta get around this thing! How is this getting around it? I built this! Oh, look, look, there she is there! She's there, she is? Alright. as well in the first game. Well, first and second. I'm actually I'm not sure about second. But yeah, in the first game for sure, it was... it didn't show the... 
bit of bit off killer. <laughs> it didn't show the pain pills, they might actually taken them. Painkillers. Oh god, it's a rocket launcher. Ooh, nice dodge. Oh shit, I lost my gold and now I'm hanging out with chopper. Luckily, I should still have a pistol. Actually no. Oh wow! Do I can shoot this? Yeah. That is very cool. It's kept my gun that I was using in the actual game. Unlike most most games, Battlefield prime example. You have two guns, and then all of a sudden you get like a little cutscene, and then all of a sudden you've got different guns. Makes no sense. That's the first time I've seen this gun properly. There was a goddamn army of these goons. Clearly, somebody wanted these girls bad. Or maybe they just assumed the Broncos security team consisted of more than a drunk American has-been and a Brazilian never was who should have paid more attention in flying school. Either way, I needed to find Giovanna before they did. I'm almost dead. Like, I will be dead any second. Oh, here we go. No! I died. Retry. Change my gun again. Where is it? There it is. There we go, watch this. <laughs> That's the <laughs> longest jump ever. Yeah. Need to go back low now, get the pain built. I knew. Ah, oh, you got kidding me. Are you serious? Okay, I guess they are. Time to do my epic jump again. Doing that by accident. 
present space to leave cover. Oh, hang on, I see you hiding around that corner. You can't even attempt to do this. Come on, I am just too pro. I've already had a shotgun. Unless, let me test them. This would be very cool. Oh my god. It actually drops the weapon as well if you do a wheel. I thought I'd gotten over how cool the fact that he held the weapon to the side was, but no. Just found that out and it's even better. Okay, where do I go? There. Yeah, I see you. Jump! Shoot! Oh, enemies reload them. <laughs> See, I mean, how, how far out is it? Oh, while you're on the floor, you can spin around. So if you land, then you ain't killed everyone. You can just go. Boom! That's very cool. I really need some more painkillers though. I'm gonna have to use a different one. Actually, I'll keep the shotgun for a bit. Just in case I get to an area. Mess. Where the hell was Passos? We were two failed cops failing miserably at being bodyguards. He approached everything with about as little preparation as I did. Maybe that's why we got along. Oh. It was necklace. Giovanna's necklace. Now I just had to find the rest of her. <laughs> Here we go. I really need some painkiller. I had already wasted enough time. If I had any hope of saving her, I had to move net. Nail. Giovanna! Giovanna! Max! Over here! What's happening? Where were you? You don't happen to have any painkillers, dude. Right. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. Basil's crazy. Is he okay? They had to make a quick detour. He's fine. He's right there. My God, it's Raul. Giovanna, what are you doing? Giovanna, oh, she's she's fucking stupid. Someone shoot her now. Hey, no, nothing. Go. Seems like I wasn't the only guy around here who had taken his eye off the ball. Are you okay? My weakness was the drink. Passos was the sister. Things were turning pretty ugly in this town. The boss's girl was gone, and part of me wished I was too. Uh. Oh, he's back to the drinks. Is it gonna end every chapter with him just drinking? It wouldn't surprise me. do we have? We have never paid out ransoms before. But I don't know. I don't like the feeling of this. What about you, Max? I don't know. Uh, I'm no expert on hostage negotiations. I, I know people who are, but they're in America. We don't have time for America. I know you're right, Marcelo. It's not like I don't have the money to pay. Father made a lot of money. We have always been targets. We all know that. But much as it pains me, I don't see we have a choice. Maybe after we pay, we find out who did it. We have them. But we 
We all know what I'm saying. Who do you think is targeting your family? Haters. Who can say? Life in this country is not easy, you can see that. I have tried to do business the right way, but that's not always possible. Of course I made enemies, but I've also paid a lot of bribes. I have no idea. It's probably that street gang trying to get a me. I don't know. People I know have tried to reach out to this group. Commando Sombra. They're not from any of the favelas around here. They're linked to the drug business now. What have I got to do with drugs? Nothing. Everybody loves money. I just want right. my wife back. <clears throat> we can take the money to them. <laughs> you don't want too happy with that idea. He's like, why are you bringing me into this, man? Come on. Open the bag, show me it's full of money. Easy. Hey, shoot, shot me. Apparently, someone up in the nosebleeds didn't like the game we were playing. The money was gone. I forgot to turn on the If I didn't get off that field, the bullets came from long range. I'm coming. They were well armed professionals, and I was starting to feel decidedly amateur. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Desperate times. Offline. There we go. Let's go. You okay? Yeah. Alright. Let's go. There's gotta be a first aid kid around here somewhere. I've been shot more times than I could remember. But this felt different. Maybe fate was sending me a message, trying to tell me my luck was finally about to run out. Or maybe I just severed an artery and was bleeding out like any number of fools who got shot playing with guns. Either way, I was failing fast. Maybe. God damn it. Come on, Max. Don't speak like that. You can make it. Possibly, if you start moving. At least one of us had a gun now. That raised our chances of survival all the way from nil to slim. He seems well, competent, okay. so he'll be alright. The guy with the bag must have got hit. He's bleeding all over the place. He's not the only one. Come on. I think he went this way. Just give me some painkillers. I'll so be alright. So this was it. My easy retirement money. My blood-stained 401k. A chance to drink for free while chaperoning socialites around town and making sure the poor people didn't get too close. The brochure sure didn't mention any of this shit. <laughs> Still would be back there, brother. <clears throat> yeah, give me some painkillers. They always cure me. <sighs> oh. Wait a second. Oh. No problem. I can do that. <laughs> <clears throat> Oh shit, you better not be dead. I don't know your name, but please don't die. Oh, yeah, he is competent. Whoa. Looks like I missed all the fun. <coughs> you see there, Grandpa? Come on. I'm getting flashbacks to that wedding we worked in Aruba. Yeah. Back to the good old days when I thought I might actually like this job. <laughs> Dumb sport. <sighs> hey, careful, my friend. That's blasphemy in this town. <clears throat> you okay, bro? Never better. Whose idea was this, anyway? Yeah, I wonder. <sighs> Is it bad? 
<laughs> what do you want? Like? Worse. Here. Thank you. Here we go. Watch. He'll take some painkillers. He'll just jump right up. Right. Yo. Mm. I'm back. Here we go. Put the sleeve on. Come on. Ah. All right. Don't be a pussy. So what now? We make sure that the right clowns get the money. Who the hell do you think that was? Tried to gate crash our little wine and cheese party. I have no idea. This is Sao Paulo, brother. Could be anyone. Huh. Anyone with access to high-powered sniper rifles and trained killers. That's pretty much everyone. Great. <sighs> Good as new. Now, Einstein. Oh, it's up with some painkillers and a bit of bandages, and now bullets and their money. And make sure they know we did not try to trick them. Otherwise, Fabiana, she won't come back. It's such a shame. <laughs> Come on, come on. There we go. There we go. Kick some more. Sao Paulo lived and died this game. That day more than most. Come on, let's get out of here. Which way did you go? Oh, you went this time. Right, let me just check the time. I'll have to end the video soon. It's almost been a full hour. What the hell? What am I doing? I'm picking up a weapon. I want to make sure. I think I might just end it now. Just, think so, just so I don't. If it gets into a cutscene, you can't skip him, which means the video is going to run on for ages. In your own time. Can I save? Oh wow, there's golden guns there. Sniper! Not like we're in a rush or anything. Oh uh, yeah. Right, I'm going to save. Not save. End the video here. So, <sighs> if you like this video, guys, please subscribe. The annotation in the top right to watch the next video and as always thanks for watching oh and don't forget to check out my twitter thanks for watching guys see ya